Hello and welcome to your third video for this week. Now those of you who've been watching the previous videos this week will know what's coming because the same four puzzles or the same four types of puzzle are going to appear in this video. For those of you who are new, have a look at the instructions on the screen. So here we have a mini Sudoku grid where each row and column must contain the numbers one to four. And at the same time, each bold square must contain the numbers one to four. OK, so each of the little squares will need to contain the numbers one to four as well. OK, so that was your first puzzle for today. Your second puzzle for today is once again, this is an inky puzzle. And the rules are that each row and each column as well must contain the numbers one to three. And then each bold shape that you see on the grid must make the total shown using that operation, whether it's addition or subtraction. So those are the rules for that puzzle. So that's two puzzles down. And for those of you who are aware, third puzzle is a Futashiki puzzle. And in this one, each row and column, again, must contain the numbers one to four. And this time you have to take into account the inequality symbols on the screen and they must be correct. So if it's a less than symbol, you must have the numbers in the right place and the same for greater than. OK, so that's three puzzles. Your fourth puzzle, your final puzzle, once again, is battleships. OK, so on the grid, we have got a set of ships on the right hand side and they must be placed onto the grid. But you must follow the instructions, which are that no ships can touch even diagonally. The ships also can't be placed diagonally. And the numbers that you see above and to the left will tell you how many ship parts are in that row or that column. OK, so all of those ships will need to go onto that grid following the instructions that you see on the screen. So once again, good luck with that. As you know, the answers will be with you later on this afternoon. But in the meantime, good luck. And of course, let us know how you get on.